guys, welcome to this second episode of Q&A's questions from you, answers from me. If you have any questions, you can leave them in the comments below and I will try to get to them. First one we have today, it's from Duke Ukulele and he's saying, where are you from? Uh, right now I'm living in Oslo in Norway, but I'm from a place called Dalen in Norway, which is a really small place and Dalen, that really means the valley. So it's a valley, really nice place, not much to do there. Um, when I grew up there, I was most of the time cycling around, skateboarding, sitting indoors, playing guitars. But now I live in Oslo. Yeah. And the next question we have is from Dominic O'Korn. Do you listen to any jazz or prog rock? Mm, really not that much to be honest. I listen to King Crimson a tiny bit, Rush maybe. It feels like I'm still too young to, to listen to jazz. I'm, I'm 29 but still I prefer rock, pop music, country music, almost everything except jazz to be honest. Maybe someday I, I will enjoy jazz crossing my fingers. And this one is from Alex DP. Hey man, loving all the new videos lately. Thank you man. Do companies send you pedals to demo or do you just buy them all yourself? In the beginning I demoed all the pedals that I own myself and I also borrowed quite a few pedals from different uh, local stores in the area. There's a shop called Vintage Guitar, which is a great guitar shop and I borrowed some pedals from them. And I used to work at a guitar store called Deluxe Music and uh, I borrowed some stuff there as well. But now uh, people send me pedals to demo, yeah. It, it would be impossible for me to, to buy everything that I demo. Just couldn't do that. And here's a question from Christopher Thunder. Question from Bartoby. Bartoby, that's Trondheim, that's a big city in Norway. I find myself less and less inspired by guitarists and instrumental music and more inspired by songwriters and songs. I was wondering if you also have it like this or if you still have guitarists that can give you the feels. Yeah, I've always been like that, to be honest. Um, I had guitar playing friends that was into Steve Vai and Satriani and people like that, and I never got it. Like when I really got into playing guitar, I was listening to a lot of White Stripes and Queens of the Stone Age, and that was the music that really got me into playing guitar because they had cool and good songs and the the guitar parts, they were yeah, cool to play and they sounded cool. It was just not noodling around or wanking off. It was really guitar playing to me. So yeah, absolutely. I prefer songwriter guitarists still. That's a very important thing to me. Um, I rarely listen to, to like guitar players who are just guitar players, if, if that makes any sense at all. I think maybe it's growing a bit on me though. Uh, I might get there someday. Maybe in maybe in five years I'm listening to jazz and I'm playing Steve Eilix, I don't know. All right guys, thanks for watching. Um, as I said, if you have a question, leave them below and I will try to get to them in the next episode. Thank you, bye.